good Sunday morning, YouTube. It's March 25th, roughly 7.15 in the morning. <laughs> Guess where I'm at? Yup, you guessed it. Back in the express bay. Get the trailer tire fixed. Imagine that. We'll check back in with you. So I got my trailer tire fixed this morning. I swept the trailer out and uh, I'm gonna go get ready and just grab my shower bag here. I'm gonna go inside, get my shower because uh, the load I'm picking up is not supposed to be ready till 10 a.m. And actually it's only about 10 miles south of here. And it's it's a, it's a drop and hook so I got an all day window to pick it up. But I wanna get it as soon as I can so I can get rolling to where I wanna stop tonight. So I'm gonna go ahead and get my stuff together here. I'm gonna get my shower. And uh, I'll check back with you. I'll show you what the what some of the Schneider facilities look like. So uh, let's go walk in there and check that out. So for those of you who are wondering, this is what a typical Schneider facility looks like. The shower. Get your bench over there. Shower. Normal stuff, just like you'd see in a truck stop. It's a little outdated, but you know what? It's always clean. And that's the main thing. So, I'm going to go get my shower. You can't see that part. I'll check back with you in a bit. Hey, look, I look like gear grabber, Mr. Wilson. <laughs> See, there's plenty of parking here. And somewhere <clears throat> in here is the godson's truck. But <laughs> I'm in the back row, secretly hidden. Only Dan Schmidt knows my parking spot. I like to park in the same area. So as long as he don't squeal on me, we're in good shape. So anyway, we're going to walk back to the truck here. We're going to start getting ready to leave. All right, 30 minute break time. So I just went in to use the restroom. And uh, once again, I'm at a plaza here on the Ohio Turnpike. These things are great, man. You can get a pretty good walk in walking around here. So went in and used the restroom. I'm taking a long way back. Just go for a quick walk. And uh, once we get back to the truck, we'll, should be, our break should almost be up. So probably about three, four minutes. So. I see an orange trailer over there. I don't know about you. That's my trailer, but I ah, can't show you the truck. Sorry. So anyway, let's head back there. And uh, we'll get ready to head on down the road. We got about 200 miles to go. I couldn't quite make it to where I wanted to get to. I would have been about 15 minutes short. So I had to stop and do a 30-minute break. Or, as Graybig would say, a DOT waste of time safety break. So... All right, let me head back over there, and then I'll check in with you. So I get back from my walk, right? Get back in the truck, and you are not going to believe what I saw when I got back in the truck. Look at this. Check this guy out. Old Bat Bear, man. Instead of getting uh, getting caught with his hand in the cookie jar, he got caught with his paw in the potato chip bag, man. Look at that. He's eating potato chips, drinking Coke, lounging back there. Man can't find good help these days what do you gotta say for yourself what do you gotta say for yourself man what's the deal I love you, Daddy. I love you, Daddy. oh yeah butter me up yeah all right go ahead keep eating keep eating so <laughs> all 
All right, I got to get back on the road here, and uh, I'll talk to you guys when I get to my park location. Well, we got the sun setting on another day. Wasn't too bad today. I'll, uh, I'll show you what we did here. Not too bad. 462 miles. I'm only about 10 miles from the customer tomorrow, so uh, yeah, all in all, not a bad day, so let me flip this around. So every now and then, you know, 99% of the time when I eat dinner, I eat out of the truck just because it's cheaper. Every once in a while, even the godson likes to splurge. So, check it out. Ooh, Godfather, look. Whopper. It's actually a Whopper Junior and an apple pie, man. What a dinner. So, I actually just went for a truck stop walk. And uh, I'm going to eat this and it's going to undo everything I just did. <laughs> ah, well. You only live once, right? So, anyway, I'm going to eat this up. That's going to do it for this vlog. Nothing exciting in this one. So uh, hopefully you guys enjoyed it. I appreciate you watching. And by the way, real quick, I just want to mention, I'll do a separate video on this in a little while, but that last video that I uploaded about the open bar tool, if anybody's interested in that tool, all the information is in the description of that video. The email addresses of who you need to contact there. So send either Brian or Paul an email and mention that I sent you there, mention the YouTube video, mention my YouTube name or whatever, and you'll get 25% off your order. That's a lot of money. And just so everybody else is aware too, I don't get nothing out of it. There's no kickbacks for me or nothing like that. I did it because I like the tool and I get to pass the savings on to you guys. So uh, it's a good tool. So if you're interested in it, you can go get more information on their website, www.opnbar.com. The ordering information is either on the website or if you want the special pricing with the discount from me, go to the last video, look at the links, send Brian or Paul an email, mention me, you get 25% off. So I think that's a pretty good deal because that tool's uh, it's not really expensive, but it's not really cheap either. So 25% off goes a long way. So, all right, you guys, appreciate you watching this vlog. So until next time, everybody be good, be smart, be safe. We'll see you down the road. Later on.